Tony Ho, good neighbor. Today, I want to pick you up, oh my goodness, and show you what happens when you use these flexible drops. A lot of bad things could happen. You think flexible drops are easy. Well, they are easy in a lot of ways, but hard in so many ways. I like the adjustable hard drops that you can screw up and down. Flexible drops, if you can't access them after the ceiling's in, well, uh, I don't even want to think about what has to happen after that. The ceiling has to come out is what has to happen. So here's a good example. Let me unclip you. And you will see, here's what caught my eye. We, at this company that I work for, did not do this TI. Of course, we did the shell. That is the shell, an empty shell. And another company did the TI. And what caught my eye was, you see these cups, they're supposed to hang down about like that, about a half inch down. And then you see them, and those are up kind of high. And this one up here, see that's what you like to see, something like that. But you, you wanna see them uniform. You don't wanna see one up high, one down low. Well, here's the deal. I found an open piece of ceiling. That's how I found out it's flexible drops. But one of the covers came off the fire sprinkler head. And now you can see if you're putting the skirts on this at a later date, after the paint is on, oh, you're gonna have a really hard time because you're not gonna put the skirt on. Let me put on you a flashlight and we'll see, see how far that head is up there. Yeah, that's not good. You'll never get that skirt on. That skirt is supposed to be down, way down. And it's on a flexible drop, so there's no way to get to the adjustment of that thing. So whoever the sprinkler company is here, you can see that that thing is way up there. So the moral to this story is Whoever installs the drops should come back and install the escutcheons or the skirts. But here's a little bit of the open ceiling. This is where you can see that they use flexible drops. So, like right now, they can still adjust that fire sprinkler head. And if I was them, I would. But this is not good. But whatever. Stop looking at other people's work and just look at yours. And make sure you do it right the first time. All right. Well, as always, I wanna thank you for coming along with me on these Heads Cut Too Short Adventures. Uh, you know the drill. Peace, love, and all that hippie jazz. Bye-bye, everybody.